May I take your order? Uh, yeah, I'll have a heart attack burger with extra meat. You can't order that. Why? Because Starflower is meeting us for lunch. So? Uh, I'll have a large Coke, please. And you, ma'am? Just coffee, please. Hello, Earth to Captain Density. Starflower is a vegetarian. Yeah, but it's not like you can contract vegetarianism. She's gonna see what you're eating and go all meat is murder on you. I hate to break it to you, but that's a mess. No, Starflower is very serious about not eating meat. No, I mean like super insane vegetarians are a mess. Nobody wants to start a conversation off with like an insult. If somebody walks in and just berates your food choices, they're gonna sound like a fundamental Christian saying, you're going to hell. You're going to hell. I'm serious here. Insanely rude Christians are a myth, just like insanely rude vegetarians are a myth. People are a lot more sensible than that. I don't think vegetarians are that sensible. I mean, a lot of them believe that meat tastes better. I'm not sure I follow you. Bacon, tofurkey, garden burgers, they make their vegetables taste like meat because they secretly believe that it tastes better. So just because somebody sticks to one already established food group that automatically makes them insane? Yes, which is why you can't order meat around them. Look, I'm going to order whatever I want and Jess can order whatever she wants. Starflower. Oh yeah, sorry, I forgot. The only discussion we're going to have about this is when I ask her, how is your food? She's going to say, good, how was yours? Hey there, Starflower, over here. Order up. Hey guys, sorry I'm late. Did you guys order already? Yeah. So what you been up to, Jess? Um, actually, it's Starflower. Oh, sorry. I forgot. It's okay. Want a heart attack burger, a Coke, and a coffee? Thank you. You know, meat is murder. You know, you're going to hell. Thank <laughs> you.